Xavier's Jordan Crawford dunked on LeBron James. Now, this happened at the Le LeBron James Skills Academy. It happened this week in Akron. You won't find video on YouTube. You won't see it here on this program because reportedly all of the cameras and the, the tapes that were rolling on the incident were confiscated by a Nike representative. According to one of the photographers, LeBron called over a Nike rep. He said, Lenny. Video tape. Give me the motherfucking video. Bring the, give me the motherfucking video tape right now. They had a conversation, and Lenny then went around and took all the tapes, and they were all given up. So you won't see it. Jay, what more do I have to say? <laughs> Because Prince James just keeps making my case for he's me. He hasn't won anything. He's turning into a lot of the things I suspected he was okay. from the start. I'll give you because, that. And I do feel sorry for you people in Cleveland being <laughs> stuck with him because this is wow. the height or maybe the depth of image and damage control because now LeBron is literally turning into a Nike puppet because now he and Nike want to bury this video just because some college kid dunked on him at his camp and they don't want it out there because it could ruin his image. So now we step away, Jay, and ever since the buzzer sounded in the final game against Orlando, LeBrick has shot nothing but air balls. Am I right? Because, yeah, I'll give you that. Yeah, You're, because, yeah, I'll give you that. Yeah, You're right. Because he refuses to shake hands. He stiffs the media. He wears an LBJ MVP shirt that Kobe and Michael never would have worn before they won one championship. Now it's check my stats, the shirt that he wears, uh, all the way to all of his posse. Continue to wear New York garb, advertising the fact that, oh, we're, we're, yeah, we're going to New York, man. That this is just, it's just sickening to me, and I just feel sorry for you, Jay, that you're stuck with him. Yeah. I Don't feel sorry for us. We've, we've, we've had a lot of sports yeah. tragedy. I have here. no defense of this. You can't. I, I, you can't defend There's it. No I almost it. think LeBron should wear a shirt that says, Hi, my name is Carlos, because he's been acting like a baby for a few months now. <laughs> I mean, good. let's be truthful. Mm -hmm. You know, I, I think we're seeing these little bouts of maturity, and this is sort of the other side of when, you, when a guy has been as high profile as he has been for a very, very long time. I mean, to be honest, he's used to being the guy. He's used to being the center of attention. And, uh, you know, I'm wondering, did he call David Stern after Courtney Lee dunked on him and ask for that video? Did he say, <laughs> ESPN, don't show Courtney Lee dunking on me? It's hard to, I still have respect for him as a player, but that respect gets a little bit lessened with stuff like this because I'm thinking, you know, I know you're, you've already proven you're a sore loser. So now, Oh, you won't even let a college kid, you won't even let, you're that concerned with happens. your image? Everybody it does. Gets dunked Everybody on. gets Michael Jordan. Michael Jordan was I was on. just going to say that. Michael Jordan has gotten dunked on. Kobe's gotten dunked on. I mean, it just is a part of the game. You can't even laugh at it. You know, remember that video of Devin Harris uh, getting shown up by the kid who beat him yes. one on one? Yes. Man, he see how fast he was? <laughs> he tricked me. He hustled Yo, me in the own court. Can you get him an NBA contract? He might be able to get something. I mean, we might need to sign him up tonight. Okay, man. All he could do was laugh. laugh. Hey, sometimes yeah. it happens. You can't take yourself that seriously, and it troubles me. It would have been far less damaging for us to see the video. I was coming from uh, the right wing, and I, and I came down the middle, and he just happened to be there. Oh, uh, when it happened, I, man, it really didn't hit me yet. You know, I was you know, I was geeked about it more than anything, just because it's LeBron. What were the other guys saying, like your teammates or the other college guys on the sideline? No, they was just telling me, just saying I dunked on him, really. You know, it wasn't really nothing else said, you know, too much. You know, just geeked that dunked on him, you know, and that was it. Is that kind of like a thing you'll take with you when you go back to school? Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. That would be the first thing I'll talk about.